blood. I die. Defend, defend, Dalu. Defend, Dalu. Defend, defend, defend. Oh, 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 oh. Alright guys, one more game. Wait, 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 wait. Are you guys remember we have a presentation next week? Oh. 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 I almost forgot about that. So, what topic are we going to present? Mm, any idea, everyone? Hmm. How about food in Malaysia? Yeah. Your idea is good, but I have a better one. Let's present about the social issues. Guys, we have the ideas, but we don't know how to present. There. Adib, Adib. Come in. Get in, get in, Adib. Get in, get in. Come. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? We are discussing about next week presentation. We already have ideas, but we don't know how to present. Don't worry, guys. I will share my knowledge about how to be a group presenter. I am sure that you all can be a good presenter too. Let me show you. Oral presentation skills, DUE 1012. Are you ready for presentation? Do you feel nervous? What is suitable visual aids to be used? Don't worry, we will guide you. Just prepare and practice. Presentation skills can be learned. Practice makes perfect. Let's see the example of good and bad presentation. Walks in pairs and brainstorm the characteristics of good presentation. Common structure of presentation. Number one, greeting. Example, good morning, hi, hello everyone. Number two, introduce yourself. Example, I like to introduce myself. My name is... Number 3, introducing group members. Example, let me introduce... Number 4, stating the purpose, objective. Example, the objective of this presentation is to be present. 
number 5 presenting your topic example let's start with I will begin by as you can see from the slide 6 summarizing concluding example to sum up in conclusion to end the presentation number 7 inviting questions example do you have any questions is there anything that you would like to me clarify explain further Confidence isn't walking into a room thinking that you're better than anyone. It's walking in knowing that you don't have to compare yourself to anyone. Comparing yourself to another person, that isn't even in your system. There's no thought of comparison. There is no competition with any other human. You are not above anyone. You are not below anyone. That's confidence. When you can get to the place in your life where comparison is dead, where you are good enough, not to others, but to yourself. That is confidence. And you can be good enough right now because you are good enough right now. You might just need to change your mindset. Confidence can be developed in many ways. You can start with your physiology, your posture. If I asked you what a confident person looked like, would you be able to tell me? Of course you would. They look strong, sure of themselves. How are they standing? They're standing tall. How are their shoulders? They are back, upright. They make eye contact. Their head is up, not down. Now a shy or introverted person might say, yeah, well, that's all good for outgoing people. But I will never be confident. Anyone can develop confidence. Some might have to work on it harder than others because they've conditioned themselves into a lack of confidence for much of their life. But anyone can develop confidence. Even the majority of shy people have moments where they aren't shy, like around people they trust, maybe family, friends, or their partner. Moments where they can be themselves fully. So the shyness is selective which means you can make confidence permanent if you consciously decide to be the person and do the things you do. Not just around those you trust the most, but all the time. Being confident doesn't mean you are loud. It isn't about being the one that has to be noticed. It's the opposite. It's knowing you're great without having to be seen. It's the silent winner. It's the humble champion. If you lack confidence, you can change. If you lack anything, you can change. You can be anything in life, including radical personality change if you are committed to finding the answers. Unlock the greatest version of yourself, your true nature of confidence, of pure positive energy. Unlock your authentic power today.